Hello, I'm Dr. Bushra Anjum, and I am serving as the Standing Committee's co-chair for the ACM Women Global Leadership. In my day job, I am a senior data science manager for Doximity, the largest medical professional network that includes over 80% physicians in the US. Hello, my name is Viviana Bono. I'm an associate professor in computer science at the University of Torino in Italy. My long-time research interests focus on the foundations of programming languages. However, lately, I have also started working on the formalization of creativity. I've been the chair of the ACM Scholarships Program since August 2018 and one of its committee members since August 2012. Hello, I'm Sharon King, a rising junior in computer science at Mount Holyoke College. I worked as a data research intern at ACMW during the summer of 2022. About a year ago, ACM Women Global Leadership started brainstorming on a special project. We wanted to focus on our ACM Women Scholarships Program. The scholarships program provides support for women, both undergraduate and graduate students, in computer science and related programs to attend computing related research conferences. The proposal is to follow up on the historical scholarship data since its inception in 2006. We want to do a potential longitudinal assessment of the impact of the scholarship on the educational trajectory and career path of our scholars. The idea was pitched to the global leadership team by Dr. Valerie Barr, past chair of ACM Women. I volunteered to take it forward and reached out to Dr. Viviana Bono, who is the ACM Women Scholarships Committee Chair. Viviana, awesome as she is, was immediately on board. I've been in contact with Bushra since she started serving. Together, we managed to enlarge the scope of the scholarships program from purely CS-related students to multidisciplinary students provided they, they work on a proper CS-related research project. We work well together, therefore, I enthusiastically accepted collaborating on this project. Moreover, Sharon Kang, the intern working with us, has been the perfect addition to the team. Bushra and I agree that the ACM women must open even more to interdisciplinarity, diversity and inclusivity. And I felt this is exactly in the spirit of the Scholarship History Project, collecting the data of the past to do even better in the future. As the project team, we have asked our award recipients, starting from 2006, to recall what the impact of the scholarship was on their journey. Did it lead to any important connections in their field? Did the conference attendance help shape their career? And was the connection to ACM women important in any immediate way or in any lasting way? Reaching out to approximately 400 scholars was a huge undertaking though, especially as the data from the earlier years was incomplete and not totally reliable. So we worked with our data research intern, Sharon Kang. I basically worked on tracking scholars who have received the ACMW scholarship from 2006 to 2019 contacting and distributing surveys, and finally analyzing the responses. This project enabled me to clean, visualize real data, and gain hands-on experience in working with data. Furthermore, the scholars who I have contacted are seniors who have studied computer science for 5 to 20 years more than me, so it was such a pleasure to see how they developed their careers and what they are working on at the moment. The original intent of the project was to see what impact the scholarship and conference experience had on the students. We received over 40% response rate, and we were blown away by the success stories shared with us. We are working on a summary report. At the same time, these stories deserve to be individually highlighted. Based on that, we are starting an interview series called Above and Beyond Scholarship, where we will share and celebrate the individual success stories of our scholars. We will be publishing these stories on our ACM Women website, social media channels, and also the newsletter. Please stay tuned.